Welcome back. Good to virtually see you again. Um, we ended the last unit with crosswalks, and I said at the time that crosswalks are a form of interoperability that, that allow translation across metadata schemas. And we're going to continue with the theme of interoperability in this unit. I titled this unit Metadata for the Web, but that's maybe not the best title I could have chosen. Really, this unit is about structured data. And a lot of data on the web is structured already, but a lot on the flip side is not structured, is what's called unstructured data. It's possible that most data on the web is unstructured. It's really hard to say. Having structure, though, allows data to be more interoperable than having no structure for the most part. Unstructured data can be passed between systems, to be sure, but having structure makes data more useful for certain types of uses. It's, it can be more easily searched. It's easier to transfer between systems to ingest structured data into a system. And that's what we're going to be talking about in this unit. We're going to be talking about different ways to structure data on the web so that it can be passed between systems. But before we look at specific ways of structuring data, let's first talk about what we mean by structure. <laughs> 